What is up boys, welcome back to a brand new video today, we are playing some more Fight Night Champion, we're diving in today against Miguel Cotto, this is going to be a very very tough fight, but it's going to be fun, Cotto does cut a lot though, so this could be one of these fights where we kind of get it stuck to a bad cut, we'll wait and see, but so far, so good in this career, you know, undefeated, 11-0, last episode we beat Chavez pretty nicely, I'm looking to do the same here with Cotto, not looking to overextend, not looking to worry too much about the shots being thrown and stuff just looking to catch him slipping make him miss make him pay there we go Ooh, Cotto had a big shot Gonzalez answers back what shot there again from Cotto nice Is that jab coming The eye of Cotto. That eye is bad. The eyebrow is cut open, bro. Cotto, one of my favourite fighters, you know, very underrated. One of my favourites, man. In terms of like modern day era, anyway, definitely one of my favourites. Oh. Okay, pinged him with that little straight there. Gotta watch my head. Nice. He's making this a rough fight though. I'm trying to anyway, he's getting pieced up, but yeah. Nice. Clipped him with that shot, that was nice. Oh coming over the top there by Miguel Cotto. Let's go. I think Gonzalez might have a cut. I'm kinda of nervous. And the mug with that jab. Beautiful. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, Miguel Cotto is one of my favourites, man. <clears throat> when it comes to like someone who just comes to fight, it's no better. But well, it's probably a little bit better, but Cotto's up there, you know. I think he had the controversy in his career with the Master Paris with uh, Antonio Margarito. Good shot there. Gonna keep moving, keep our hands up. So, I know this is going to be so far out of when this video will be posted, but I posted a little photo yesterday. I bought a oil painting of Roberto Duran on uh, Amazon, and uh, I put it on my Instagram, and Duran commented. <laughs> it made my day. I thought I'd mention it in this video, you know, it's boxing related and stuff, and you know, I was fangirling. I literally was like screaming, oh my god. <laughs> Paul Counter and Koto to pieces now. Okay. Let's go. Nice. Double jab there would have been nice. We haven't rocked him yet. That's something I've realised. We haven't rocked him. He's hurt, I think. Coming in, he's getting clipped with that straight though. Nice. That blood is flowing bad for Cotto. His face is a mess right now. Again with another straight. Gonzalez looking good here. Just reset. Straight after the shot. Nice counter there from Cotto. Land a big shot. Reset. Stand back. Reset. There we go. Good jab on the way in there. Nice jab. They should stop this fight, man. His face is an absolute mess. Another round down. you got to think, you know, Gonzalez took that as well. Look at his face, bro. That's bad. Nice. Blood again. It's flowing. Don't want to play with Gotto, though, because he's a freaking savage. Try and get him out of there if I can. I think we will. I think it's going to be maybe a late finish. Which, I, honestly, I don't mind. I don't mind going to distance. I feel like Colin, Colin, um, the creator of this fighter, will, uh, will be fine with that. And I think uh, Gonzalez will be as well. Big, uh, big shot there. That opened up the cut again. I don't know if it was sealed or if it was just not bleeding, but yeah, it's definitely bleeding again now. 
Ooh, oh. Good strike there. Catching him a fair bit now. He's landed on me though. Oh, okay. Here we go. Miguel, you don't want to be here. I told you you don't want to be here, brother. You don't want to be there trying to finish me. Because we can come back with something just as vicious like that. Drops him. Told you you didn't want to be there, brother. Here we go. Back to the feet. Barely. Now the first knockdown has occurred. Nice shot though, that rocked me. I was not expecting that. Nice. Something Gonzalez does very well is circle. Oh. Don't want me to throw these combos, Miguel. Because you'll be out of here quick. I don't want to throw them either. I want to box. I'm gonna throw. I kind of save it for when I have to. But realistically, I do want to sit back and kind of pick shots and move around and just fight smart, you know? Nice. Shot to the body there from Gonzalez. Let's go. Have a straight lands. Beautiful shot to the body. Counter, perfect. Keeping that jab going. Ooh. Yeah. And again, landing clean. And again, that jab. Good combo there. He's covering up better, which is good. Good for him, anyway. Not for me. <laughs> Oh, buckled him with that one. He hit one in the throat. I mean, every time he does, he gets stung, so. Like that. Got, it. got him down in the end, boys. We got it. Oh, here's the guard. Let's go. That could be it. I don't know if he's going to get up from that, to be honest. He's got up. Miguel Cotto, you are an animal, and I love you for it. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. I send this now. Didn't want to be there too long, you know. If he's hurt and he's walking around, like he's, you know, wobbling all over the show, let's get him out of there. He might get up. Nah, he's done. He's over. It's over. Miguel Cotto has not been able to beat the count. Gonzalez gets it done again. Unbelievable. Mauls Miguel Cotto. Very tough fight in terms of the fact that we just kept hitting him and he just kept coming. But there you go. There you go. Let's keep rocking. Let's keep rocking. And uh, let's just see what happens. I'm, I'm excited to see where we go from here and, uh, you know, what happens. Um, I would like to get, like, uh, maybe we can jump up in the rankings. Okay, what a streak. Who is this against? Uh, I don't know who you are. He's ranked 12 and he's 31 and 7. We could take that fight, to be fair. If there's no one else, I'll take that fight. Um, I wouldn't mind taking someone like Mosley or someone like that. Let's see. We beat Chavez. We beat... Yeah, I'm going to take that fight. I'll take that fight, I guess. Um, and move into like the next bracket of fighters, I guess. Let's go. Please have not booked a fight. Yeah, there we go. Rank number 19 v rank number 12. We're getting back in there, boys. Here we go. I think we're going to just keep going to Big Bear now. I think that's probably the best thing for us. Go there. Get scrapping. Let's go. You love to see it, boys. We won Defensive Fighter of the Year, Jose Gonzalez. Let's go, baby. Let's get it. We only had two weeks of camp for this one, boys. We have one week training and one week to rest. We're going to see what happens, though. This dude's a southpaw. Okay. Let's see what happens. Gonzalez, the Oliveras. Very unorthodox. That's going to cause me problems. Very unorthodox. And you don't stop fucking throwing. Jesus. Alright, you motherfucker. 
suits her about. Oh! Dude, this guy has to land like that. Fuck. Dude, I expected to land good, but not like that. God damn. I just expected him to keep coming. But, okay. I think we've, like, you know, got some respect now. He's going to be a little bit more... He's done. He's finished. He ain't getting up. He's done. That's over. Done. Done, though. You want to rush? You want to rush me? I told you we got combos, bro. Let's go. Is that 13 and 0? I think so. One round, bro. One freaking round. Steamrolled in. 13 and 0, it is. Let's go. And that was a short notice fight as well. That's going to put us on notice. Uh, short notice fight if you're interested. Who is it against? Shane Young. Oh, Miguel. Fuck off. We just beat him, bro. I don't want to fight him again, to be honest. Like, especially when we beat him as bad as we did. Like, God damn. I don't want to do that. Tim Bradley. Here we go. Victor Ortiz. Emmanuel Gonzalez. I'm going to go for Tim Bradley. I think that's going to be a fun fight. Well, let's get it. Let's dive in. I'll do some training. I feel like we could do some training on video. Uh, just because, you know, <laughs> we're mixing in now and again. It could be fun, I guess, if you guys want to see it. Um, we'll see what happens here. Um, okay, right, let's get into sparring. We've got four weeks as well, which is nice. And that last one, we only had two. Um, but it didn't really matter because we still steamrolled him. So that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, let's see what happens. Let's rock and roll. Tim Bradley up next. Uh, he's a very short welterweight. So it could be a pretty good night at the office for Gonzalez, to be honest. I'm just going to rumble in sparring. We always just get close and just brawl, pick our shots. And... Kind of where the staff of Petrovic was born. You know, wait for an opening and explode. I mean, it works pretty nicely, to be honest. Especially if you're just trying to get points in sparring. Not oh, there. Okay. Beautiful. Nice. Jab with the body upstairs. Left hook, another shot there. <laughs> Let's go. It's not doing great than it. This dude just wants to kind of chill. There we go. We kind of need him to rumble as well to be able to get these like points up. 35k. We need 40 for a good camp. For a good session, I guess. Oh, oh. Nice. That was a beautiful knockdown right there. Let's go. Got up 40. Beautiful. Rumble with him a little bit. Boom. Nice, man. Keep moving. Boom. So far, man, I've got to say, like, this career has been very, very fun. And I think, you know, we... It might be the best career ever. I don't know. That's a bit of a push, but it might be. It's up there for sure. Clips him again. I wonder if I can knock him down. Yeah. I was going to say, can I knock him down before the sparring session ends? And we could. Let's go. Ooh, okay. He'd be good there. So our training is very, very good. I don't know what we can even increase at this point. That session was very, very good. Uh, our toughness is definitely something we're going to increase. There we go. Um, and then we have one more week of training, like a light session, and then we're going to go from there. So let's see. Our stamina is very good. Let's go for some reflexes, some tennis ball catching. Go from there. And then, of course, we're going to go and rest. Then it should be time to fight Tim Bradley, I think. Let's go. Let's go, boy. Here we go. Tim Bradley up next. I wonder how this is going to go. I just think he he's a little bit too small, and I think we're going to, you know, we're going to stand with him. We're going to we're gonna pick him off, and it should be all over. We'll find out, though. He's a very small welterweight, like I said. <clears throat> we'll try and keep our distance, you know. Jabs and straights are going to be our best friend in this fight. He's itching to get close. He's going to have very good head movement, trying to slip our shots and come back. Can't get into it. Oh, can't get into a brawl with him, Bradley. Need to stay away. 
There we go. Nice. Hit me with a good shot there, though. Didn't expect it to land, to be honest. But that's fine. What you got, Timothy? Jab. Just counter. Quite hard to counter. He's moving very well. Oh. Okay. Good shot. Tough fight. We're not landing as clean as I want. His head movement and blocking has been superb so far, man. Right there. On the way in, you think it'd be easy to hit on the way in. He's not. Very hard to time. He's, he's moving side steps, you know, swirling. He's got his head movement on point. His blocking's on point. He's very hard to catch on the way in, which is difficult because he wants to get up close to you. And brawl with you. You know, you want to keep the range because you know you've got it, you know, you want to keep that reach advantage. I can't seem to fucking land on this little guy. Oh, look at this, bro. Yeah. He might have won that round, you know? He might have won that round. Let's go again. Round two. That's good there. If I come out a little bit more aggressive though, I do think I'll start catching him. He did clip me again there though. Well, these shots just ain't fucking landing, I don't know why. Oh, good. There we go. I'm gonna let him think about a few of those shots, but hold that, you know? There we go, there's two more for you, Timothy. I've got some more, just wait there. They're cooking at the minute. Nice jab. I want to hit him with the straight. I think our straight is a little bit harder than the jab, obviously. Nice uppercut. Yeah. Very elusive. Oh, clipped him. I can't wait for no man. I'm taking him out if I can. He's too elusive. He's too tricky, man. I've got to get him out of there, you know? Fuck that. <laughs> He's definitely getting up, yeah. No doubt about that. Very tricky, though. Very, very tricky. Okay. Try to step back there and land something going backwards. Didn't really work out the way I wanted it to. Can't lie. Movement. This motherfucker on the way in. It's ridiculous. I'm struggling to hit him clean, to be honest. Very elusive. I have better success in this angle. I doubt it. So a lot of shots being missed. And of course, if you're missing shots and then he's ripping your body. You're looking at a bad night in the office for your stamina, so there you go. Round three coming up. We dropped him once, we can do it again. Nope. Fuck you, he's good there. Part of me wants to just walk forward and, you know, land something. Yeah, fuck it. Come here, Tim. Come here, Tim. What's good? Banded in the game plan here a little bit, but I ain't fucking landing. What do you want me to do? Get beat by a little dude. Nah, I don't think so. This little guy ain't beating me. Let's go. Now we take the fight to you, Timothy. What you got? That straight is not landing for fuck all. There we go. Yeah, Zen, it kind of had to. Oh, bang two shots there. Let's go, Tim. Nice. That's what we need. More like that. There we go, baby. He ain't hurt. I wouldn't say he's hurt. And again, I've been wrong in the past, but I don't think he's hurt. 
part, I guess. That's so clips him. Good shot. Beautiful. What you got? What you got? Nice. He's not throwing much. Very idle fights now. Ooh. Come back in with that straight down. I don't think he was expecting that. Keeping on him with a jab. One, two. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Good rounds. Very good rounds. But again, kind of tough. Kind of tough when it comes to just accuracy wise. That was nice. That was real nice. They're still ripping him. Okay. He wants it in the middle of the ring. He shells up when he goes on the ropes. You don't want it there, boys. There we go. Okay. I'm just going to brawl him. I think we can get him out of there for a brawl. Right, well, like, what is this? Is this a boxing match right here? Like, what is this? Let's see. Okay. That's like a four punch combination. I've counted there, though. Oh! Turn that one over. He's hurt. He's hurt. Can't find him though, boys. Need a map. Let's go, Timothy. What you got? Oh, straight in the mug. And that could be it. Boom. Clean as they come. He's getting up. He's getting up. I already know. I already know the animations, boy. Been doing this too long. <laughs> He's done, that could be it. I don't know, the way he went down, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Nah, he's done. He, he could be done. He's taking too quick a time. Yeah, he's done. Nice. Timothy Bradley is out like the rest of them. Very tough fight. I wouldn't even mind running it back with that guy. Very tricky fighter. I can't even lie. Like, I was chasing my tail for the first round. I couldn't find him in there at all. I just, I don't know what it was. I just couldn't find the chin. He was very elusive. He moved well. Hands up. Good blocking, good head movement. Good footwork and uh, yeah, 37% I landed. Jeez, that's that's low for us. He landed 16 though. I mean, when it comes to percentage, we had better, but still not very good for us. We usually land about 50 to 60% of our punches because we are pretty accurate in the way we like to, you know, throw. But there you go. It is what it is. I wonder if we can get another offer real quick, um, just to see. One second. Short notice fight. Who is it against? Zab Judah and Shane Mosley. I'll take that fight. I'll take that fight. That will be in the next video, though, boys. For today's episode, I am going to end it here. Thank you so much for watching. If you have enjoyed it, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you for more EA Sports Fight Night Champion next time. So, awesome, guys. Have an amazing day. See you all again in the next one.